Hey fellow garden gnomes, this is Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. If you saw my live stream, you know that I'm no longer in Ottawa anymore with my gardens. Um, I'm now in Miramichi, New Brunswick. I'm going to be here until the end of December, which means that unfortunately I won't be able to do as much with my gardens at home. Um, I'm still hoping that there'll be a few times that I'll be able to fly back to Ottawa. I don't, I'm definitely not going to drive since it's like a 12 hour drive, but um, I might fly once or twice, uh, definitely around Thanksgiving, which uh, around that time I'll probably be taking my sweet potatoes out of the ground and probably just putting my bed completely to rest. So while I'm here, I am staying in an apartment. Um, I was able to get a two bedroom apartment, um, a lot less expensive than what you would normally find in say Ottawa. So in my second bedroom, I decided to put an area for some plants. So I'll show you that right now. So this is my little container garden um, with a little watering can. Definitely if you're gonna have containers indoors, you want some either a uh, tablecloth like this, a vinyl tablecloth that's easy to clean, or you might want like a little tray to put each plant in, just so that when you water it, and some of the water falls down to the bottom, it doesn't end up all over your nice hardwood floor or nice wood tables. So right here I have Swiss chard, basil, kale, and lettuce. And I basically found these in at one of the local grocery stores. They had uh, a sale on these big containers with different varieties of plants in them. So this is all different varieties of Swiss chard, different varieties of kale, different varieties of lettuce. The lettuce is getting a little scraggly because I've harvested it from it a few times. So I'm thinking about possibly finding some lettuce seed and just taking out these plants and uh, sowing some new lettuce. But this has been a really nice little salad garden for me. Uh, I've been able to uh, have my main dishes, dinner, have a nice little freshly picked salad on the side, and I'm really happy with this. I've, I've been thinking about, you know, putting another pot, but I must admit this window is pretty tiny, so even when the sun is coming in, it's really only a little strip of it, so I'm not sure if I would be able to get another container into the sun. So what you see me doing right now is just uh, picking out the dead leaves. And this is just good for decluttering, making sure that all the leaves that are not dead are able to get access to sun without being blocked out by, by dead leaves. It also makes it ultimately easier for me to harvest uh, the leaves that I want to harvest when I don't have to dig through all this dead matter. So that was just a really quick video showing my little container garden that I have here and I think this really goes to show that even if you are in an apartment with no balcony, no outdoor space at all like I am, you can still grow a few plants and uh, you can really make a dent in your produce bill. I mean, I don't buy any greens anymore um, because I have my own source here. And there's so, in addition to uh, costing less, that's also great because if I get greens from the grocery store and say I don't use them immediately, there's a chance that they will go bad, in which case I've just wasted my money. But with the greens here, they're basically good until I decide to use them. And then when I want a salad, I come over here and I clip off some uh, leaves. And then I have this nice fresh salad. So if you like that little update, please give the video a thumbs up. If you're interested in seeing more, please hit that subscribe button. And until next time, stay wildly green.